All right, so this next one looks like a, oh, it's like a, it's like a street racing game. So yeah, I'm not much into racing. Are you into racing games? No. All right, well, let's okay. check out this one together. Yeah, there's, there's two. They're what? I, I just, they're, I do like them. I just can't maneuver. Oh, no. Yeah. Some of them are good, but it's just like shooting games. Like first person shoot, like like Modern Warfare or Call of Duty, those yeah. games I usually have one of that I'm playing at any given time because they're all very similar to each other. Uh, but let's check it. Let's check this one out. We are watching the trailer for Overpass 2 reveal trailer. PS5 games. We're gonna like the video. This has 34,000 views and only 1,000 likes. Hmm, I don't know. Gear up for the ult. Well, it might just be because 30,000 views, 34,000 views isn't that many. So, so it might just be that the, the game itself isn't that popular. Uh, anyway, um, gear up, or sorry, the game genre. So anyway, gear up for the ultimate off-road adventure in Overpass 2. Control powerful vehicles on challenging courses that test your skill and, pre and precision. Become a renowned driver in career mode. Rise to the top. Challenge friends in exhilarating races and dominate the leaderboard. Explore five unique environments with 31 thrilling tracks across different game modes. Choose from 37 licensed vehicles, including UTVs, ATVs, and exclusive rock bouncers to conquer any terrain. It will launch 19th, 2023, uh, sorry, October 19th, 2023 on PlayStation 5. All right. Uh, let's check it out. Got a 59 second trailer. This is the reveal trailer, by the way, too. So, our first look. Okay. What is a UTV, by the way? I never heard of it. Isn't that an ATV right there? Yeah. So, what's a UTV? Me TV. I TV, her TV, his TV. <laughs> okay. So you drive? I just want to point out that we're 43 seconds into a 59 second trailer and all that we've gotten so far is the name of the game, some music, and then the and guy driving. <laughs> yeah, and that's it. And just a dude driving. Which is fine. I mean, I'm sure that's going to be the bulk of gameplay, but I thought you would have... thought you would have at least showed him doing something interesting while driving. Like a jump. Did you just ride up so also about having like an 18-wheeler? No, no. Basically, ATV... No, it says right here, look, UTVs, ATVs, and rock bouncers. What is a UTV? Rock. I know we're gonna look it up. Okay, so this is okay. No, no, no. So this is a UTV. So the things we saw them driving are UTVs. Well, then what's an ATV? What the heck is going on here? Oh, ATV is is without the top. Okay, 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 okay. What is a rock bouncer? Let me see, rock bouncer. Okay, it's like, uh, I wonder oh, if the lady, I wonder if the lady is included. I'll, I'll buy that for a dollar. <laughs> okay, there you go. <laughs> no, so, so I'm sorry. The game might be great. I'm not saying that it's not. Okay, I'm just saying that this trailer doesn't show us anything. I mean, okay, so you have your character. Cool. I would have expected that at about 20 seconds, this would have switched to showing us something else. So we've got, okay, racing. This looks good. This looks good. Okay, see, you see how it's cutting and showing us different interesting things? Then right here, it just starts showing us behind the guy camera, uh, like it's just him driving. And I'm like, why are we spending so much time with this guy just driving? Wouldn't it be cool, like jumps and flips and different vehicles or something? Rolls over. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm just, I'm really just critiquing the trailer, not the game itself. So probably the game is great. It's a racing game. You can go race a rock bouncer and you have a lady in a bikini sitting in front of your car or whatever. <laughs> but, um, 
I don't know. I just I just would have liked to see it'll. You have fifty. You have you have basically one minute to show me. And I think that there was just a few times in here that they rested too long on the same amount of footage. But anyway, uh, the same type of footage. But anyway, what did you think? I think uh, I agree with you. I think the game looks okay. It's just they they could like mechanically. Yeah. Mechanically, it's excellent. I think the CGI is really good. Yeah. I think the game per func per production will yeah. perform well. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, maybe if they would have shown us something about the customization, I know that I know that you know, usually they have a little compilation of where it's like showing you you changing your vehicle, picking different paints and whatever that would have been cool to see i guess i don't know i'm just i'm again just rating the trailer not 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 so much the game but i don't yeah, understand why the helicopter was there yeah that was weird it, well i mean it's not like i said again not that it's bad for the game itself but yeah i don't you didn't have to show us a, the helicopter uh let's see if so overpass why what i put an overpass and what the heck is this okay so overpass let me see so this is overpass i just like a like an add-on for the overpass game but i want overpass like can, can you can you show me overpass there we go so this is overpass mixed reviews and it cost 40 dollars sorry it cost oh. 30 30 dollars and it's the old game. So probably this new game is going to cost like six, 50, 60 bucks. Um, and let me see. Overpass 2. Let's just see if I can find out how much it costs. Um, overpass 2 price. So if you're into racing rock bouncers. Yeah, I can't see the price. I don't think that it's two hundred twenty-eight dollars. What? Are you kidding me? What are you talking about? Okay, there it is. Right. No, see, it says overpass. It doesn't. It, I can't find the actual price. Why? Good. This isn't. Oh no! Never mind. It. That's some kind of service. <laughs> overpass two, game price. Um, I can't find the price. It's probably going to be a AAA title, though. So this is so you're looking at if the old one today costs thirty dollars. You're probably looking at a sixty, seventy dollar game in the Overpass Two when it releases. Um, yeah. So again, like we said, graphics look cool. Mechanically, it looks like it plays. It's going to play, you know, at least decent. Um, yeah. Just wish the trailer would have showed us just something else. There's, there's, you know, I mean, obviously it's a racing game, but there's got to be more to the game than just you turn the game on and immediately you're in a race. Like, you know, so anyway, well, let's check out. They only showed you the UTV. They could have showed you, you know, what the ATV did, what yeah. the bouncer did. Yeah, that's a good point, too. There you go. Yeah, exactly. Uh, let's check out what uh, people are saying in the com Oh, here. I want to do this. Cool. I love vampires. Man, I really miss MotorStorm. Can you guys imagine MotorStorm on current gen hardware? MotorStorm was an old school racing game like this. Um, love seeing all these games that didn't make the roster for the showcase. <laughs> uh, you know a racing game will be bad when it used licensed music instead of quality car sounds. Actually, that's a good point. Do you notice that as they're doing it, you know, like in a racing games, usually it'll show like the front of the vehicles and you'll see them shaking and it goes, vroom, vroom, you know, huh? and instead of hearing any of that, <laughs> We're listening to music. So, yeah, it's like music overlaid over the over the sound effects. So that's an interesting uh, thing that he pointed out. <laughs> yeah, hope the game is play is better than the bad choice of music for the trailer. <laughs> Don't count on it. No offense to the game and the devs, but the trailer is obviously hiding details. See, that's true. Okay? That's true. Um, the... the the game, the gameplay that they're playing 
is the is is fine, right? Like I'm not saying it's bad, but you're using all of your time to just show us this instead of show us anything. I don't know. Like it's just, just it's just like there's more that you could have shown us. Go watch yeah, a Need for Speed. Go go watch a Need for Speed trailer. You'll see some things. So that makes you wonder what are they not? W there must be a reason. This then that's what the comment was saying is basically there's a reason why they're only showing you that because the rest of it doesn't look so good. So. Um, just let me read through this one more here. The original game was a mediocre 4x4 trial. It was a mediocre 4x4 trials game, but with UTVs and quads. For no particular reason, a much worse off-road drive, if you ask me. The sequel seems to add more actual racing. No idea on how big UTV trials will be put. The poster vehicle of the game is one American rock crawler. Is some American rock crawler, excuse me. So there you go. People don't seem actually that excited about this, uh, criticizing the original game, criticizing the trailer. So um, if you're interested in it, you can check it out on October 19th. And then just like the original is for sale for $30 on Steam um, with mixed reviews. So, uh, yeah. All right. Actually, and it's funny because it was released in 2021, but it only has 71 reviews and only 54% of them are positive. Uh, not the best thing. All right, but let's move on. We got one more trailer, so we'll watch that, and then we will be heading out for the night. Okay, so here we go. Don't forget to check me out on Twitch and join the Discord where you can voice chat with me while a live stream, and you won't be recorded or anything on YouTube and Twitch, so that's pretty cool. You can also find me on Facebook and Instagram. If you like to read, you can see my after-action reports on my blog, and if you are interested, you can get some merch from my Spring store. The links for everything are in the description below.